And we've got a lot of celebs tonight. we got Will Smith, everybody. Yes. we got Jada as well. G.I. Jane 2. Can't wait to see you. <laughs> it's a joke, everybody. Come on. <laughs> Will, come here. What's up, babe? Come here. So you're just going to let him disrespect your wife in front of these white people and you're just going to laugh like, <laughs> like our Uncle Tom, huh? You f***ing when I'm talking. You're just gonna let me come and disrespect you at the Oscars in front of all these people and you're not gonna do something. If you were any bit, any tiny bit of a man left, you go up there and you go and slap him in the throat. You would do that. You would do that for me. You would do that for the family. You would do that. Because if Tupac was alive right now, he would shoot this whole club. But no, you wanna come and laugh right now. Huh? Tupac died in the car trying to protect me. But you can't go up there and go and slap a comedian in the throat. Huh? Because of the Oscars? Who's the real joke? Who's the real joke, bro? You be a man. Be a man for once and go and do something. Oh my God, you are so intoxicating. Like, why would you go and do that? Like, first of all, what, is it every time I go to tell you to do something, you go and do it straight away? Don't you have a bad tone? Huh? If Tupac was alive, you think he would do something straight away when I told him? He would make me beg. And second, I'm not your wife. We've been divorced for five years. I told you, don't say wife in public, I say. Say partner. How many times do I fucking have to tell you? You never get it fucking right. And that's my problem with you, Will, because you're just in it bad You're not a man. Like, Will, I just, I just feel as though you're not as romantic as you used to be. Like, you don't tell me how you feel like you used to back in the day. You know what I mean? Like, you don't give me words of affirmation. You know how important that is to me. You don't do acts of service like you used to. You don't give me gifts. And when I say gifts, I don't mean anything expensive. You know what I mean? It could be something that you handmade. You know, Tupac, when he was alive, he used to write me poems from jail and he used to spray his cologne on the letters. And it used to smell even when I used to get them. Like, stuff like that is just beautiful. It just means something. I just need that. I need more of that. Okay. Flowers, anything. Just something that... I, it just shows your appreciation for me. Well, baby, it's actually funny you said that because um, I got you these flowers and this picture with a poem um, on the back as well. Oh my God, you're actually so gay. This is so corny. Like, Will, you're actually a cornball. Like, the fact that you thought this was okay and you're worth like 50 million and all you could muster up was a poem and flowers. Now I'm gonna go on every TV platform promoting my book and telling everybody how much I miss Tupac because Tupac would never do any corny shit like this. Like, the fact that you thought this was okay is actually pissing me off. Like, Tupac actually made my insides tingle. You give me the ick and we've been married how long now? You dis you disgust me. Like. Oh my god, like you actually are a sick man. Hey Tupac, she's talking about you again. Who? That Jada bitch. Oh my god. Bro, I don't even remember talking to this bitch, bro. What's fam, she's doing too much.